Check this out, it's another one. I can't believe it. to another fossil hunting episode yeah that's right <laughs> here I am once again same spot that I was in the last week and today I I need to do a different approach so if you remember last week I've kind of got lost in here so I was searching for a path of the sea urchins Ooh. and well I've been here a couple of times and I, I found out that path that was uh, full of little sea urchins and I was trying to to reach for that and I end up finding that area where I found those huge gastropods and today instead of climbing that hill uh, that is very exhausting uh, I'm going to try a different approach well I'm already at the top of this other hill in here so I'll try to reach that area uh, and explore a little bit better because I've got a feeling I've got a feeling that there is probably there is more stuff around probably it, it was very unexpected for me to find those huge gastropods in this area uh, well I know that there were fossils in here but I never would have thought that there was such a kind of those gastropods those huge gastropods I never would have thought that they were in here as well so I already found those those type of the, the, that species in a different location very far away from here and it was very surprising to see that they are in here as well so today we have nice weather so it's cloudy but that's the way i like it because we don't have uh, much sun hitting the back of our neck and we can do some nice explorations the only thing that is bad it's the lightning conditions light light conditions sorry not, not lightning <laughs> so I hope that the video will turn out okay so we have a nice view over here so one of these days I, I sure need to explore that other hill that is in there oh they dropped something in here from some sort of construction see oh, shame shame that is shame see that other hill over there so one of these days I have to explore that other hill as well but today I'm concentrating in this area so as I was saying when I, when I decided to to come back home if you remember I found out in the middle of this road a nice piece of of uh, of nautiloid so it is it is something that was unexpected for me as well so uh, looking at the ground I already am seeing some pieces of well, there are oysters in here. Okay, so, but I'm not going to waste time in here. Now I'm going to head back to the area where I found those gastropods. Oh, they, this is a nice picture as well. Check this out. Oh, nice sunrise. And the clouds, clouds are very low. So I hope that the weather stays like that. Uh, it's fresh. It's not too hot, so it's cool. So, as I was saying, I'm not going to waste uh, more time in this path, maybe when I come back, because I want to get straight to that area. Because if you, if you can see, so probably they, they, these, these uh, rocks that are in the road were dragged in here by some sort of tractor. And the area where I found those gastropods seems to me that is pretty un untouched, so no machine is there. So probably the fossils are in situ. Uh, over there so I really have a nice feeling that today I'm going to find something cool and if I have time I will try to see if I can rediscover the path of sea urchins because uh, this area doesn't seem to but it's very big and it's easy to get lost because there's a lot of paths 
and some 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 other ones that are new that were built by the guys that do BTT and it's very easy for us to get lost in here so oh my god I have to take a picture because it's too beautiful uh, one picture for Facebook let me show you guys I'm going to pan to this side oh, 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 oh. this is very cool very very cool so give me a moment guys be right back check this out so cool the clouds almost look like they are rising from the the hill over there so very very cool I, I, one of these days I have to explore that that other hill that is in there probably there, there's more stuff around I love blue skies but I also love the clouds so so friends I'm kind of well not lost but not quite sure where was the spot where I crossed the road I'm not sure if it was this road or if it is that other one that is down below uh, I remember that there was some sort of of exposed bedrock like this one so uh, well uh, I'm in the right spot because if the machines try to remove this rock from here they wasn't they weren't able to because looking at the looking at the same it almost looks like they it was a puzzle so this wasn't a move around by any means so what uh, was in here still is in here and we can see that this 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 that is in here continues over to this side i'm going to investigate this maybe uh, we can find some i don't know dinosaurs footsteps in here <laughs> that that will be awesome okay the exposed bedrock continues over to this side it's very flat nothing i, I could not find anything but there's bits and of stuff laying around and well it's kind of a tricky because almost uh, all of them look a little bit round roundish uh, and I can determine if there is a fossil if there is a fossil or not so I have a lot of road to go yet oh there is another exposed rock in here let me check this out because the ammonite came from from one of these places probably uh, oh <laughs> friends no this is just this no no it's not possible check this out check this out friends are you seeing this rock in here see this line over here i believe this is one of the spirals of the arpa godish oh no it not and if it is in here i hope that it's comp oh it's a fossil all right check this out it's very curved almost looks like a neck shape oh this is going to be awesome so <laughs> let me unpack my tools and I will start to excavate well <laughs> uh, I'm again full of excitement and I, I need to keep calm because sometimes when I'm doing this I don't put the camera in the correct frame and I'm doing something and you guys are not seeing so I'm going to start slowly because I don't want to mess this uh, it, the, it, is, it has some sort of uh, I guess something hit hit him in here but the rest overall it's quite well conserved just let me take a picture okay now let's start and see if we have any luck in here or not well luck we already have because this is right in the middle of the path so if there is one of these fellows there's probably more and I still didn't uh, found the place where I was <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is going to be very interesting so uh, let me see if I can pull it from this side mm, it's going to be very hard to remove this okay over here I need brute force okay and let me see if I can remove this other bit okay no Well, if it is complete, it's going to be awesome. 
awesome awesome let me see if there is if it's still going oh it's still going so okay that's a good indication okay let me see the other side now here it's going to get tricky because most of the times they are broken broken on this side so oh there are still bits of the shell in here see oh i have to be careful with this one oh this is going to demand a lot of fine work and patience so i'm not really sure if i'm going to be that patient because sometimes i'm a little bit Oh, it still continues over. Woohoo! Nice indication. So, the shell here, it's gone. Okay. Okay, okay. Well, sometimes I make things in the hurry. So, today I will try to be a little bit more careful. I already know that there is gastropods in here, so they are not going anywhere so I might be a little bit more patient oh this, this is not going to come out like that I just want to lift this rock mm, this is going to be very difficult with just one hand I need a cameraman any of you guys want to be cameraman? <laughs> okay, this one is out. Okay, nothing in here important, so I didn't break anything. So Okay. The spirals continues over. Oh. I will save this for the last because this probably is where the bad things happen sometimes. Well, but this this kind of uh gastropod we don't have much that problem because the spirals are um are uh, squashed inside of the the shell the other ones that are up they have the spirals outwards so they are more prone to to break so just give me a moment i'm going to take another picture just for the record okay let's continue continue with the extraction okay it's cool over here as well i'm not really sure if this is just dirt or if it is rock there's pieces where it's dirt and I guess there's something, a, kind of a rock in here as well, that's hedged against the fossil. Okay, now let me see the other side, this other side, if I can remove more. Okay, what's this? This is kind of a white stuff. almost looks like there is something as well in here see it's a bit different from the others hmm. okay see this is round as well so I'm not really sure what I'm seeing so I just need to be careful so I'm going to try to remove the rocks that are around here Ah. This is going to be very, very hard. Oh. <sighs> Who needs gym? Okay. Mm 
going to come out like that no way it's going to be more difficult it's not making things easier so guys I was saying that I will stop the recording but well I, I, I probably am going to stop recording because I need to use both hands what's this another rock so oh this is going to end up I'm going to end up breaking this and this is part of the shell with oh it's already broken it's shame i want to salvage as much of the shell as i can but it's going to be very difficult what's this let me see not really sure so the shell is gone no uh, this is going to be very very difficult to extract Okay, I'm going to pause the video just a moment. Let me uh, work a little bit and be right back. Okay, okay. Now it's easy for me to work like that. So, okay, it is gone. Oh, let me show you guys. Check this out. Let me see if the spirals are complete or if I'm not wasting my time. Still isn't conclusive. No, they are complete. Here's the other one. Whoa. Okay, okay. <laughs> nice. So let's continue a little bit. A little bit more. So far, so good. Difficult. Okay. So far, so good. Mm, still not able to pull this over. And I guess the, I guess the tip over here, it's a little bit crumbling down and broken, cracked. Sorry, that's the correct word. So, it's going to be difficult, difficult. So, <laughs> I guess it's out <clears throat> or not. Mm. It moves in a funny way, so I thought it could be... Oh, it's out, all right. It all, it's all moving, so let's hope it's all complete. I'm going to remove this bit very, very gentle. Oh, we still have a nice impression in here. So, I'm going to put this in this side. And what about? Mm. 
Oh, this is the other part of the fossil, so it broke over here. Oh, this is the part of... The Sorry guys, I didn't... Uh, uh, uh. It's, it's also part of the fossil, it's part of the shell. It was very large, it's almost like a mantle of some kind. Because if I look over there, it's round, but it continues over to this side. So this is part of the fossil. It's very, very large. Oh, this is this is breaking in, in this area, so I have to put this... Uh, don't fall. So I'm going to mm, I'm going to put in here. So let's see if I can remove it. Okay. Oh, but let's just hope that everything is complete. Uh, one. Okay. It's exiting. Oh, oh! This is magnificent. Check out this beauty. Oh! It has the spirals also. Check this out! And this part over here, so I have to put this on the ground. Oh, but this is massive, massive fossil. And this part over here, let me just grab it, fits right in here, so it's part of the top. It cracked right here in the middle, and it was not, in, it's not my fault because this was already broken, or else it was white. So, that leaves in my conscience a little bit better so it's a large gastropod very very large so I have to keep all of the pieces like the puzzle so when I arrive home I can reassemble oh but this is very nice check this out very 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 nice and again we have the those scars on the top as, as you can see so it kind of almost looks like the shell cracked and that is just part of the mold. But the spirals are complete. Complete! Oh, one more in here. I'm in the right spot. Well, if I found another one in here, well, <laughs> I have my day complete. So, I was closer than I thought. So, I was uh, looking at that certification. And then I came a little bit down the road look at the ground and that was the spot where i found that those that huge gastropod and if i looked to if i had looked to my left side this was the place where i crossed the road so i was lost in the middle of all of those bushes over there where i found the other gastropods and i found the other one right in here so this area over here uh, must be full with this uh, arpagodes incertus that's for sure I'm going to take a look around in here. Probably there is more stuff. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to have the luck that I have over there. So they have to be visible because I'm not going to ex excavate in all of this rock. Oh, looking at the ground. Check this out. <laughs> it's amazing, quite amazing. Check this out. Right there, <laughs> there is a tiny one in there. <laughs> very, very tiny. Ah, uh, this is a gold mine in here. And that, that is what I said in the other episode. There is areas in this place that there is no fossils around and there's some huge uh, outcrops in certain areas, but it's very, it's very um, concentric to that, that spot, so it's not scattered around. So let me just check if there is anything else in here, so I'm not, well, now everything looks like a gastropod. Okay, I'm going to put this in the bag. Okay, so now everything looks like some huge gastropod, but check this out. Nothing out of the ordinary, so probably is nothing. But remember this from last from last video. Something round and it has this indentation in here. I guess this is part of one. Let me see if I can take this one bit around oh it was so it was round and it was and it says the oh of course this is part of one this was part of the inner mold of the shell of one so oh, there's more stuff in here I have to keep my eyes open because probably there is more stuff around let me see and oh don't tell me don't tell me Check this out. Maybe this is another one. 
in here. Mm. No, this is not. It's very, very eaten away in this side. Oh, but it's it's another one. <laughs> Check this out. It's another one. I can't believe it. And it's very easy to remove this one. <laughs> it's another one. <laughs> Check this out! Whoa! Whoa! Check this out! I cannot see the spirals, but the shell, the outer shell is almost complete. Whoa! Check this out! The shell is complete! <laughs> hey, that's amazing! And it was right in here. Let me see if I can take this out without breaking anything. Okay. Okay, it's out. Let me see if I can see the spirals. Whoa, it's another one. Oh, and it was right in the middle of the road. The spirals are gone, but maybe with some water I can clearly see them. But the top, it's complete. Oh, it's falling apart in here. Oh my God, this, just one of this is very heavy. I'm not sure how I'm going to Oh, and I'm seeing another stuff. Oh, <laughs> check this out. If that wasn't enough, see this concavity in here. This is indication that one of these fellows was in here. This is the signature. So probably it was flip, flip upside down, but it was in here. So we've got this other one. Oh, let's see if I can find more. Oh, this is a gold mine in here of huge gastropods. Well, well, well. Who so, I came to this side of the road because there it's way too difficult to excavate. And I was looking at this other uh, bit over here. And check this out. This other one, I guess it's another one. It's so camouflaged in here. And the spirals, I guess they are all gone. I guess this is another one. And it is another one. See? The round bit. <laughs> they are everywhere. Everywhere. Everywhere you look, there's a gastropod. <laughs> Whoa! It's another one. And the spirals are coming outwards. So, that is the reason why I found the other one right in there. So, there are so many that one one of them end up uh, be stuck in there so there's one in here and I'm not sure <laughs> what's this in here as well maybe it's another one oh who would have thought that there are so many in here is another one yes yes indeed two in the row Woohoo! now I just need to excavate and it's not going to be easy. So this other one has the spirals. Well, very eroded. You almost cannot see anything, but if you look carefully, you can see the, the swirling in this side. Pretty neat. And the other one that is in there, it's unknown. Well, if, <laughs> if I started like that, uh, I'm going to end up with the bag full of stuff. <laughs> Okay, let's start the work. I guess I'm going to start this one. It almost looks like it is easier because it has more ground. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe not. This was the little fellow that was in here check this out so it's amazing and well the reason why i'm showing you this now it's because i tried to record the video uh, while i was extracting from the rock but there was a problem with the the card oh and it's breaking in this side as well so it's kind of oh it's kind of crumbling down in this side so i hope that everything is okay when i arrived home with him and this other one that is in there I'm not really sure if I'm going to extract it today 
because I already have two or three of this kind and this is very heavy and I'm far away from my car I'm not I'm not really sure how I'm going to carry all of this home and I have to leave some for other occasions so the main purpose of today was to find some <laughs> some gastropods and I achieved that but I wasn't expecting to find so many uh, well I'm going to look around to see if I can find more this other one that is in there it's going to demand a lot of work to just to remove it from from that matrix so I'm going to just leave it there for other occasion that that I came in here what I am going to what I am seeing in here no no it's <laughs> I'm seeing gastropods everywhere so I will look around to see if I can find different stuff because it all Today it's all about gastropods and uh, I sure hope to find different stuff like ammonites and, and so on. So this is a little nice fellow so and it's heavy one or two kilograms and we have a little bit of shell over there of, over there as well. Yo 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 friends <laughs> check this out there's something in here as well. Woo! What do you think this is? So I hope that the camera is working properly now. Uh, not really sure if this is anything. It's round. It's full of moss. <laughs> and this is a gastropod, no? Oh, it's a tiny one. Woo! It's a smaller one, smaller version. <laughs> it has the spirals a little bit gone, but it's nice. It has the moss. Oh, I have to be careful with this one because it's a little bit cracked over there. Nice. Oh, this is gastropod land. <laughs> this is not central gastropod, this is gastropod land. <laughs> okay, this is a nice area to explore. And check this out. Uh, this is pretty neat. I'm not really sure what this is, but guys that love minerals would like this of course pretty nice very white i'm not sure if it is calcite or quartz but it's cool and it was just like that so i'm not really sure if i'm going to take this home with me because i'm already heavy on fossils so i guess there's a lot of stuff to to investigate in here very 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 lots of stuff okay what's this What's this? What's this? Oh, it was nothing because it cracks all over the place. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm starting to get worried. Okay, I'm starting to get upset because I start to recording and my camera start to make a curious beep. And I'm not really sure if, <laughs> if this is going to be recorded on the memory card or not, but uh, anyway, so I am exploring the area. I am following this slab of rock that uh, is in here and I am trying to follow uh, this path over here because when it rains it drags all, all of the little bits of the material down to this path that is full of moss that is indicative of having some kind of water. So I'm going to follow and I am going to see if I can find any more stuff, probably more gastropods. <laughs> Uh, I hope um, uh, and I hope that my camera starts uh, will record this uh, properly or else I'm going to record with the GoPro but the GoPro is not very good of making some macro shots for you guys to see the nice details of the fossils so let's continue okay uh, again the snails the snails this is not going to turn into a fossil because it's already cracked. <laughs> okay. Uh, but I sure wish to find today some sort of ammonite. I already have plenty of gastropods, but what is this? What is this? Let's see. What's this in here? There's this bit over here cracked. Oh, another one. <laughs> Another one bites the dust. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, I would never thought on saying this, but today <laughs> there's too much gastropods for me. 
<laughs> okay, cool. Let's see if there, is, if there is anything else in here. Okay, they are in here, but they are very, very disguised. So I'm a little bit lower than the the stratification of the road. Oh, I'm already seeing one that is broke, and it wasn't me. So I guess this is another one. Check this out. Check this out. Shame. This one wasn't me. And it's broke for a long, long time. What's in here? So it's almost irrecognizable, but there is something in there. That's for sure. Ah. It was like that. Oh, and there's a, sh a piece of a of a shotgun shell in here okay got to be careful <laughs> or else but this is part of one uh, but this was exposed to the elements for a very long time I don't know how this was was like that well this is crumbling down okay this one will stay better ones there must be better ones, that's for sure. I just need to try to find them. What's this? Mm -hmm. Nothing. Okay, okay. Okay. And what is that? What is that round yellow bit? It has a hole in here. Check this out. What is this? Just a funny rock with a hole in it. Oh! <laughs> I have this bit in my... Oh! Check this out. I was looking at the hole in the rock. Check this out. I guess this is another one. Mm, and it is. It's a, it's a juvenile. Junior! Come to me, Junior! Junior! Yes, it's a juvenile. Check this out. Another beauty. Oh, but it's a little bit broken. But anyways, it's still cool. Okay, this is gastropod land, for sure. <laughs> for sure. Okay, now I'm going to. Okay, what is that? What's that over there? Check this out, friends. There's something in here. I was putting this in the bag and there's something in here. Something here. What's this? It's round. Ugh. Let me see if there is any bugs. Okay, there is a nice piece of shell on this side. But I'm not sure what this is. It's a gastropod. Well, it's a shell. What's this? Quite puzzling. I don't see any spirals yet. Maybe they are hidden in the in the shell that is attached to this side. It has a huge chunk of shell, chunk of shell, chunk of shell. Sorry, <laughs> attached to this side, and it's cracked all about in here. So I'm not really sure what this is. Uh, I'm going to put it in the stash it somewhere okay and then one of these days I come back yeah, funny thing. okay oh <laughs> check this out what's that what's that maybe it's another one uh, I don't really know for sure well it's part of one top layer of one okay this one will stay because I already <laughs> Friends, I was messing around with that rock because it's round. Check this out, right at my feet. Check this out. Oh. <laughs> Check this out. It's another one. Let me see if it is. Hey, it is. Check this out. Check this beauty. Check this beauty. <laughs> there are gastropods everywhere in here. And it has the bottom tip as well. Ah, amazing. So nice. The spirals are cool. 
we have the scars on the top I call it the scars I don't know if it has the specific name but this one is very very cool oh that's pretty amazing very very nice I'm wondering if this other bit that is broken in here if it isn't uh, something of the shell that prolongs itself well I didn't saw I didn't see any one with this complete but it's a theory friends I'm not sure if I'm going to <laughs> search for more fossils because I have to to bring this home oh now the Sun is starting to appear Woo! <laughs> uh, so uh, uh, um, I'm not really sure if I'm going to search for more fossils because I already have enough for today I want to leave some <laughs> <laughs> for the next time and probably the next time I will return in here as well so I'm not really sure how I'm going to bring all of this all of this with me what's this in here as well it, it's every rock that you look it might contain a fossil uh, but I already have my bag full some of you guys said, well, the Jurassic, why do you use plastic bags instead of using something out of fabric? It's way more resistant. So, uh, for one reason, if I use fabric, I'm going to end up putting a lot and a lot and a lot and a lot of weight inside of the bag. And it's going to be very, very difficult. And if it is from plastic, it keeps myself from putting too much weight because I, w I am afraid of uh, losing the bag and that is a way to control myself because if i if i don't have that chance i'm going to put uh, such amount of weight in the bag and it's going to be very very harmful for me uh, i could put the the fossils inside of my backpack but yet again it's harmful for my for my back so uh, keep in mind it's all about the fun it's all about the making exercise we don't get don't want to get hurt out here and we have to be safe so uh, for me guys uh, it's cool today i found a lot of fossils but today it's it's enough i, I cannot bring any more so i have to leave some and i still didn't find didn't found the 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 path of the sea urchins and it's a and that has a lot of lot of stuff in here to explore so uh, <laughs> Uh, so friends uh, I guess I'm going to head home and I'm going to clean these fellows because I have a lot of them in, inside of my plastic bag so let's head home so fellows here we are back at my place I managed to take all of the fossils out of the bag so it was pretty hard to travel along with all of these friends that we have in here so these are the juveniles that I found today so it's a little bit sunny here but you get the point so these are the juveniles the less uh, well the smaller ones so the smaller ones are this size <laughs> so uh, this other one was the one that have the spirals a little bit camouflaged so I have to wash this uh, very carefully so I didn't wash them so they are as they were when I found them so this is the bigger one that I found so it's cracked over there but I will try to fix that so I guess this is one of the largest ones that I'm going to have in my collection this is the most perfect one so it almost is complete uh, I guess it's because of the matrix because this all of the matrix is still attached to the fossil and I'm not going oh god so sorry friends this this one is falling apart because I tried to put uh, put the fossil together with all of the, the pieces that were loose and it's a little bit unstable so I'm, I'm trying not to to mess around with this one uh, um, I will try to put I try to put it together but it will take a while so now you get the point so these are the, the ones that I bring back home there are quite a lot and you know that I left some behind so maybe I will return there maybe well, almost for sure that I will return there so I have uh, I have some problems with my camera as well so uh, I'm not sure if you are going to see the videos because th it was giving me memory card error but I found these exogyras as well so I guess they are pretty neat uh, especially this one that has this curly bit like this so pretty nice so I bring m more two more but well now I will try to wash the fossils very well and let's see 
uh, if I can put one of them back together so I'm going to start this one because it has uh, this large part so friends I need to show you this beauty check this out <laughs> it's uh, fantastic it's just the inner mold but it's fantastic okay I'm washing uh, the fossil with the, an old toothbrush because I don't want to scrub very hard so it might get the those uh, dark spots but I guess I'm going to leave those spots for now uh, I just want to clean just lightly so so my friends here we are back at my office so now this fossil is already dried and we have some pieces that I want to see if I can glue them back together. I have, uh, well, this is a lid from some sort of package and I have some epoxy glue over here, so I'm going to mix the two and I will try to glue this back in this other uh, side of the fossil. So this is going to be the area. So let's hope that this will turn out okay. So I have some some uh, clips over there to grab the the fossil in place. So let's hope that everything will turn out okay. So so this piece is a uh, drying. So uh, I sure would have liked to have this piece over here to complete the spiral. But anyways, I guess it's it's looking cool. Uh, just miss a spot over there. So I'm going to. I bring this bit that belongs to here, I guess, no, like that, yes, like that, just like that, so that is another piece, so I'm going to uh, see if I have a little bit more glue, epoxy glue, and put that other bit back in place as well, so. So friends, that's about it, so these are just some of the pieces that I've been working on, so this is the larger one that now it's complete so I glue uh, the shell back together with some epoxy glue so it has a huge crack but well it's in place so overall it's looking I guess okay by the size of it oh I'm not sure if I'm if I return to that place if I can find another one like this this size so this other one that is in here gave me a lot of work because it was broken in a lot of different places so I need to glue back the shell together so I know the guys that you in the movie only saw this bit but there was a lot of different bits over there and I tried to bring them all together so I can put as much as I can of the of the fossil uh, in one piece so and this other one is the the one that is uh, one is in one piece and it's more detailed than the other ones so no cracks uh, so guys I know that this was a longer than usual video but if you like the video don't forget to put a like and subscribe and I'll see you back in the other movie bye